Palestinians in villages in the West Bank have voted in municipal polls amid increasing frustrations with President Mahmoud Abbas after he cancelled promised parliamentary and presidential elections earlier this year. Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi's personal Twitter account was hacked once again by cryptocurrency scammers, with a tweet from them saying that the state considers cryptocurrency as legal, knowing that India forbade the use of bitcoins in 2018. Thousands of Serbs have taken to the streets with three consecutive days to demonstrate against pollution caused by heavy industries and mining companies that continue to mine for lithium that damages the environment. The recent renovation of Vienna's significant Natural History Museum collections provided curators with a new test of how to display its vast trove of human medical remains without crossing modern red lines of ethics and good taste. Four days after taking office, German Chancellor Olaf Scholz pays an initial visit to neighboring Poland. Tensions with Moscow over its military buildup near Ukraine are likely to be discussed amid fears of a possible Russian invasion.